to me, I really feel this is just baseless fear. G government have we call what we call fear for unknown. They don't know what they are fearing, but they have come too much fearful. And and I pray that they should really release Dr. Kiza Besize immediately. It is really very unfortunate, but uh, it is important that uh, the political space is restored in Uganda, that everybody is allowed uh, to, to, to play the kind of politics that uh, he feels or she feels uh, can bring about change in the country. Why would you go to the extent of, if UPDF did that, to the extent of arresting Ikiza Besige with a known home in Uganda? Why would Uganda arrest him in Nairobi? So amazing. It um, says a lot about this country and um, the levels of human rights uh, abuse in this country. Besige is an old man. Looking at Besige, those of us who loved him when he was youthful and having interacted with him, he's now an old man whom you can just summon and would come and appear before you. Arresting somebody like that and run with him uh, in, in breach of all protocols of foreign protocols is wrong. Not even his family knowing. I saw a message of the wife, uh, the Honorable Bianima, looking for the husband. She doesn't know where the husband is. Very detrimental for our country and we should condemn it in the highest way possible. So the Ghanaian government has to come in to explain what is happening. Because the people who are kidnapped, what they call arrests, is being done in their country. And they don't go through the court system to be uh, expat expatriated to back.